皆さんこんにちは。私は江本マサルです。Uh, hi, hello everybody. My name is Masari Emoto. And we would like to know、um, a little bit about your background, how you discovered the, that water responds to consciousness. I know, 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 水の研究者やあるいはあ波動を測定する機械、えー、を開発している人たちに出会ってまあそれに、えー、最初は商業的にね輸入をしていたわけですがあそれを自分で扱っていくうちにその機械と水とのお、まあ、併用ですねそれによってその水の中にいろんなあ情報が組み込まれることをまず Initially, I was、uh, traveling to the US a lot for、uh, business. And、um, j- just from the business standpoint, I was coming to the US. I really didn't know much about this field, but then I began to,、um, to find a lot of、um, huddle measuring devices here. And so then every time I would come, I would meet more people who Were interested or already using a device that will measure、um, vibration or frequency of people. So then I furthermore I understood that、um, water does retain a lot of information. So I became very interested in knowing more about it. Well, of course, the connection is the same as the system, but the system is the same as the system. やはり、えー、人々はなかなか水に情報がないという感じで納得がいかないという人が多かった、まあ、そういう中で、えー、それをなんとか、えー、証明をしてみせたかった、えー、そして、えー、ある日雪の結晶の本に出会ってよしこれだということでひらめいて水を凍らして、えー、結晶を撮影することを試みて成功したわけです。So,、um, I did have a lot of confidence in this machine and device and how it would measure、um, people's frequency and vibration. And I also had a lot of proof in the sense that I did get a lot of results. However,、um, the public, general public, was、um, excl- exclaiming and saying information in water. So, no one really believed me or this、uh, method.、Um, however, I didn't want to give up. And I really wanted to pursue this because I knew there was something in here. And so、uh, one day I met this book that had a list of、um, snowflakes,、uh, just snowflake book or something. And I really felt the、um, attraction, I really felt attracted to the crystals. And then I thought, well, what if I can take water crystals and、um, have sort of like a support or proof that?、Um, Vibration does or information can be retained in water. How did you develop the process of photographing water? What exactly? How would you explain the process? Well, the sample of the water is 150 degrees. So, the water is minus 25 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 degrees. First of all, it's very quite easy to do this.、Um, I take the sample water of the crystal photograph that I would like to take into 50、um, separate little petri dishes and then freeze it in a freezer of about minus 25 degrees centigrade. And for about three hours. And after that,、um, one by one, each petri dishes, I'll pick it up and、um, have uh, the fo- fo- pho- photographer、uh, take the crystal photograph. So, the, at what point is there a crystal with frozen water? Is it when it's、uh, mm-hmm. melting? Hmm? 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 撮りました時に見た時に見えるけど<笑>どういう質問かよくわかんない
、その結晶が溶けてる時ですかそれともその数,数秒間その顕微鏡の下にあのシャールを置いた時ですかそれともいつその結晶が見えるんですかマイナス25度で、えー、凍らせるわけですからコチンコチンなわけですよ最初はねでそれがあ顕微鏡の光を当てるとどんどん温度が、えー、どんどん上がってきます温度が上昇していく過程において、えー、それがあ出現をしてきますでまあその間というのは溶けて消えるまでは約2分間ぐらいの短い Well, initially, when it's minus 25 degrees and frozen at that temperature level, it's absolutely rock solid ice. So then I will take that petri dish, put it under the microscope, and from the light of the microscope, it'll start melting a little bit. So at that point,、um, the crystals emerge from the water.、Uh, however, the life of a crystal is very short, it's about two minutes、um, generally. It's, it'll last about two minutes. What were some of the first、um, things that you wrote on the, picture, on the、uh, glasses that you wanted to see how the water was going? あの初めにそのどういった言葉なりあのを書かれましたか実験で。まあ、言葉の実験あったのは相当後のことですけどね。えー、最初はもちろん水道水とか自然水とかあそういったものを取っていましたから。えー、言葉を始めたのはもちろん。うん一番白くのがはっきりしている言葉、まあ、あまり言いたくないけど、バカ野郎とありがとう。それをやりました。Um, initially, when I started taking crystal photographs, I didn't really、um, start with putting words on water.、Uh, the photographs that I took were、um, comparison between natural water and maybe perhaps tap water. Uh, or municipally treated water、um, and so forth. So, from that, it evolved into、um, writing words on water or showing words to water. So, initially, I started off with just basic, simple words that are very clear in their、um, opposing meanings. So, for example, like thank you versus I hate you or you fool or something like that.、So. And what have you discovered about the relationship between、uh, water? まあ、あのこの結晶というのは何だろうかと考えた時にこれがやはり振動というものがもたらすデザインなんだなと自分なりに推理をしてもしそれならば音楽を聴かせる前後で結晶が違ってくるはずだということから思い立っちその実験をしそして推理通りであったわけであります。Well, initially, I believe that vibration will change、um, some sort of a structure or you know, the water itself. So, I, I, I believe that these crystals are the design of them, of the crystals, are what vibration designed or brought forth. So,、um, I had this assumption、um, or image or thought that music must. Have an effect on water as well. So, after having water hear music and taking its crystal photograph,、um, my assumption was correct, and I was able to take、um, crystal photographs after、um, having water listen to beautiful music. So, have you found that、um, different kinds of music affect the water differently? Yes, definitely. How would you、um, describe music that would have a healing, looking at moving into the ideas of healing? The healing 効果のある音楽というのはどういった音楽でしょうか、まあ、それはあの水が作り出す結晶が美しければ美しいほど、六角形でなんか美しければ美しいほど、それはヒーリング効果があるものと私は考えます。えー、なぜならば私たちの体は、うん、70% 以上が水で構成されているわけですので、えー、その水の中の情報振動が活性化することを私はヒーリングというふうに定義していますが。Um, 
when I take these Christo photographs, I know that a particular music that I had the water listen to is has healing properties or is good for the person or the body or for the water by looking at the Christo photographs. That's pretty much evidence for me, whether that music was good or bad, quote unquote. So um, from, from that information, I... I understood as these information being able to be um, have have like its structure within water that'll create the beautiful um, crystals. And from looking at those crystal photographs, I can tell which water has a particular heal healing property or whether it is a good music or not. So speak a little bit more, more about um, the universe is all vibration and the energy fields and things. あの、宇宙とかがあの、振動ま、全て振動というそういう説に関して、あの、どうまでますか。え、水質みましょうかね。え、から、すれば、やはり水質のものは振動からなりたっていうということは間違いない。初めに言葉ある人言うことも欲ぐり解ができます。え、それはなぜそういうような考え方になるかというと、ま、水というものを20年間、うん
思うんですね。ですからその最初のお全て1回2回3回4回というふうにいくわけですので最初のスタートポイントがあこっちの方に向いてるのかあっちの方に向いてるかによって、えー、人は健康にもなりまた健康にもなるとういうことだと思うからすなわち、えー、意識というものが、えー、全てをおーヒーリング的に言っても健康的に言っても。えー、その持ち方が、あ、それでを決定してしまうというふうに考えていいです。Well, I don't think that、um, vibration starts from a, like a big vibration.、Um, I believe that from a subtle or small vibration, it develops into a bigger vibration. Therefore,、um, like for example, like sound, it'll start from a visible level that we cannot hear,、uh, or at least with human ears. And then it'll gradually increase its level to the point where you know, we can hear as sound. Therefore, from a physics standpoint, I believe that、um, this level of vibration is called、uh, the smallest、um, unit of vibration, will be at the element- it'll be said to be at the elementary particle level vibration. So,、uh, not so much the physical vibration.、Um, That I'm speaking about, but it's people's consciousness is definitely、um, an energy as well. And that、uh, feeds into creating whichever direction a vibration might、um, occur, meaning that this subtle vibration will determine the person's health or、um, unhealthiness depending on which direction that vibration is going. So,、um, Therefore, I can say that depending on what sort of consciousness or intent or feeling that person might have will determine his or her health or well being. So, could you please explain、uh, Hado more? Well, Hado, do you know, I 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 know, Um, Hado is basically, to put it simply, it's,、um, it's like chi for、um, the Chinese、um, culture and prana as well as we're hearing these days. So I think a lot of people would understand Hado as being very similar to these two words. So,、uh, however, you know, I'm Japanese and this is a Japanese word. So I wanted to use Hado to describe the subtle energy or vibration. So, could you explain what、uh, you're doing at, with your Hado Institute? So, the Nihon IGM, the Nasa, the Oshigoto, do you know what you're doing? So, the Kenku. Well, no, Kain Soshina, do you know, stay, a mind schemas, the Kain, 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 はい、を有料で使用しています。まあその中で、え、波動商品なんかも紹介をしています。あともう一つのまあこれは研究部門ですね。これが三大の今冷蔵庫がありまして、え、5名のスタッフで毎日帰り、え、いろいろなテーマに
あの今その人類が水に対してどういう意思を持ってどういうあの行動を取らなくてはいけないと思われますか、まあ、水は自分自身であるんだというふうにお考えになっていただければ一番間違いない正しい方向性の,うんの態度が取れると思いますね。Um, I believe that, um... If you understand that water is yourself, then you will treat water as you would like for yourself to be treated. So, you will, if people can understand this concept, then it can't go any, in a wrong direction. And will, people will take appropriate action that'll, be, that'll coincide with what their belief is. Well, it's all, 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 まあ、できるだけそのようなあ思いで接する。例えば自分がバカ野郎と言われたら嫌だし、あるいはあ,ありがとうと言われれば嬉しいし、あるいは無視されるのはとても嫌だし、えーまあ、いろんなことがやはり水も同じなんだというふうに理解をしていただきたいと思いますね。Okay, so not... This may not be an easy concept for everyone to grasp, but for example, if I can explain a little further, no one likes to be ignored or no one likes to be called, you know, you idiot or you fool or、um, whatever. So if you do understand this, then you will, if you understand that water feels the same way too and that water is the same as us as well, then、um, uh, like I said before, we will take appropriate actions. Um, that will be kind and caring towards water, water as well.、Um, just、um, expand a little bit more on the idea of intention. あの人の意思 In relationship to healing. その、ヒーリングに関しての人のその意思ということに関してもう少しご説明いただけますヒーリングというものの定義を皆さんどのようにお考えか分かりませんけれども。私はあ、まあ、癒すという目に遭うればということになっちゃうわけですが、えーまあ、やはりこれは振動、正常,正常であるべき振動が何らかの事情で、えー、正常でなくなってしまった、そこには必ず精神的なストレスとか肉体的な苦痛というものがいずれ伴ってくるわけですが。その振動の歪みというものを強制し本来の,本来のものに戻すことをヒーリングというふうに私は考えています。ですから意思,意思とヒーリングということの関係となりますとやはりヒーリングというとこちら側が相手に与える行為というふうに考えられますがその基本的な意思がどのようなものであるかということがとても大事なことです。Okay、um,、for me I would like to explain how I take my take on what the word or the meaning or definition behind healing is. Um, I am not sure what other、um, people may feel about the word or、um, the meaning behind healing is. For myself, this is, this is something that corrects irregular vibration. So, when, when a vibration is supposed to be a,、um, a certain wave pattern, or a certain,、uh, yeah, certain wave pattern, and becomes no longer that、um, healthy or good pattern, This, this irregularity in the、uh, wave pattern will be caused by things such as psychological stress or physical、uh, trauma, or、uh, again, physical stress as well, or emotional,、um, uh, emotional distress will cause、uh, irregularity in vibration. Now, when that happens, our body might become unhealthy or not balanced. And in order to fix that to its original state, Uh, so that that person is at its best or health,、um, health wise. This process of bringing irregular vibration back to its original state, I believe that this is what healing is. 
Therefore, when I speak about intention, uh, the relationship between intention and healing, um, healing is a give has a giving property. Um, it gives healing. It gives you know regular vibration or brings back um, people to health or wellness. So I think the most important thing in relation to intention here is to really understand the original source of where that intention or that feeling comes from. で、そのヒーリングの方法もまた様々にあるわけですよね。えー、例えば、うん、カウンセリングという言葉だけのヒーリングもあるでしょうし、あるいはマッサージ。という手段もあるでしょうし、あるいは香りなどを、まあ、調合してヒーリングするということ、あるいは、まあ、ハリキューなども当然ありますし、ケネシオロジーなどもそうですし、まあ、本当に実はあのたってもその種類はあります。音楽療法もそのうちの一つでございますよね。で、あの、2つにだけど分けられることができると思います。2つのタイプに分けられることができると思います。長いからそこまでのお願いします。I think there's a lot of ways to bring about health or healing.、Um, and some of the methods that I can or、um, a mod- mode of healing would be,、uh, for example, like one-on-one counseling, group support groups or group counseling. A massage a therapy, aromatherapy, or acupuncture, or kinesiology,、um, and many, many others, of course.、Um, many, many others, and of course,、um, sound healing as well. And I can divide all of these healing modes into two types. First, one is the healing of 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 the healing. そういうヒーリングと、それからヒーリングを与える人が一人、子であり、そして受ける人が多数の、えー、要するにまあ音楽だとかそういうものとなりますね。まあ、そ,れそれによってやはり、えー、そのインテンチの意思というものがあ変わってくると思いますね。So the two types would be、um, a one-on-one healing. Like a counseling and so forth, where、um, one healer and one receiver.、Um, the other type would be where there is one person who is healing the masses, or one,、um, one item or one、uh, method that'll heal many. So, depending on which、um, type of healing、um, it is, I believe that the intention changes.、Um, At that level, too. Person to person, the way you are, he will attain the stoga, a son of stone, no, you do not, uh, mention the law, a ma, personal history, mokumete, are you a then taking a joe, who are you then say taking a joe, who omo, suete, who, um, he does it, you know. あ形の上でね、上でのこうヒーリングというものがあ理想的でありましょうね、まずね。しかしそれはなかなかあ難しいわけですが、あまあ,あ、どんな場合にも、まあいいや、そこまでですね。So for example, like a person to person counseling or a one on one healing. Would require probably typically finding out the history, whether it be past or present、um, life, or just within this、um, lifetime as well, knowing what exactly happened in that process and being able to extract as much information as that、um, healer can in order to really be able to heal、um, the client. So, although this is, of course, difficult to do to understand, to, to understand everything that happened to that person. というのは、振動を引き出すということは、共鳴現象の関係にならないと引き出せないわけです。えー、例えば、その人の悩みとか、過去の本人も知らない潜在的な苦痛だとか、そういうものに対してすらも、
それを引き出すには、えー、共鳴現象という位置関係にならなければならない。それはヒーリングを行う方の方にとっても非常に苦痛なことです。And I say that this is difficult because the most important thing here, in order to be able to,、um, uh, to receive a lot of information from this、uh, particular client, for example, like from the,、uh, from the healer standpoint, is that there needs to be a rapport or what I call resonance. So without the resonance, you know, the healer won't, will not be able to understand. What this individual went through in the past, or be open to, you know, for that client to be enough so that whether it's conscious or unconscious or subconscious, to be able to extract、um, as much information as possible. So, in terms of、uh, being able to have resonance、uh, on a one on one basis,、uh, this is what I think is most important and、uh, quite sometimes difficult to do as well. で、基本的に、その、ある一つの、お重要なあ意思がないとお、時にはヒーラーが、そのものが死んでしまったりします。えー、そういうケースを私はよく知っています。Because fundamentally, if,、um, if this concept is not understood cor、um, correctly, then、um, how important intention is here as well from the healer's standpoint. Then I have seen so many cases in the past where the healers will、uh, become ill, and sometimes、um, it'll be fatal as well. Myself, I exper experienced、um, becoming ill and、uh, being very on the verge of、uh, deathbed as well. So,、um, oh, he, he said that he's not done with his answer oh, okay, yet. Okay, okay. <laughs> Sorry, no, it was very interesting. <laughs> 例えば音楽のように、えー、一つのヒーリングミュージックというような人をに愛を与えるんだ。そのような意思、意図を持って作曲をし、それを作られるというケースがありますが、あその場合にはあ、相手の顔は見えないわけですよね。ですから、よっぽどこれは、あ作られる方がですね、相当に、そうね、言ってみると、うんえー、相当に、その、奥,奥,奥深い、うん、包容力のある、うんえー、思いやりと言いましょうかね、そういうものが。And the other type,、um, which I would like to explain, is、uh, the one healer versus the masses or a group of people. For example, this、um, mode could be applied or utilized by, um, uh, by um, I don't want to say industry, by,、um, by a group of healers, for example, like sound healers. You know, having music play to a group of people.、Uh, this, for this to be、um, effective, there needs to be a lot of love to be given. And、um, because this is very difficult when it's one, one healer or one particular item or、um, a method、um, that'll be、um, applied to a group healing purposes. Because in this instance, the healer. Cannot see the individual person's faces or have a one to one interaction. So, to compose such music that will have healing properties, this, I feel that this needs to be done by someone who、um, has a very deep understanding、um, and compassion to be able to write such beautiful music that will resonate with the masses and have、uh, healing properties. <laughs> Well, 
相手が一人であろうと、二人、あの、複数であろうと、やはり基本的に自分を、おー自分が発する、えー、振動の、振動に対して、えー、まあ私に言わせると愛感謝の思いをフィルターとして、えー、かけないと非常に、まあ、危険なことにもなるしあるいはあそのような音楽を作る場合には切り音楽を作るような場合にはそれがないと何も動かない。Therefore,、um, whether it'll be、uh, towards、um, healing one person or、uh, a group of people, if the healer does not have the feeling and intention of love and gratitude to start off with, which would be the source from that healer standpoint, then、um, it can, this can be utilized in a,、um, so to speak, like a dangerous way as well. That may be detrimental and not healing.、Um, and also, from the healing standpoint, for example, having healing music,、um, if this is not understood,、uh, meaning that if, if that healing person composing the music or writing the music,、um, or the healer not having the intention of true love and gratitude, then there will not be any effect or will not have the maximum effect. Beautiful, thank you.、Um, Perhaps you could talk a little bit about、um, your. Thank you, Barbara. Yes, that was, that was wonderful. That was wonderful.、Um, and we're, wrap, we're almost done.、Um, get into a little bit about talking about peace, your interest in peace, and、uh, what people can do to bring more peace into their life. I know you're not going to hear all. I know. Hey, what? 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 I know. まあ、あの私は水の研究者という立場からうんやはり水ということに、えー、絞ってといっても水はまあ万物の源だからなかなか広くて大変なんですが、まあ、あ水うまず最初に、えー、できることということできないことというのはやっぱり現代人としては非常に限られているわけでありまして誰でもできることをしましょうよということで、えー、あるならばそれはやはり水に対していつも感謝の思いを持つような思い、えー、そしてそういうような生活をしていきましょうということを伝えてい、えー、っておりますそれがどう平和につながるかということはまあ。Um, if you are asking about what the general public can do on a daily basis, what I can say is that just to send love and gratitude towards water. The Suruga, those the hair, it's a little bit of 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 a でありまして自分の心が美しければ水も美しくなる水も美しければ私の心も美しくなるそういう関係になると思うんですねですからあ多くの人たちが参加することによって、えー、水がそのいいコール MC の字をというあの、えー、公式の通りの
量において、えー、その美しさを増した時にその美しさはそうでないような人たちの心をも美しくしていくってくれる力を持っていると信じているからです。Um, and how is this related to world peace? You might ask. Well, I always say that、uh, water is the reflection of your soul. And this is something that is something like、um, you know, chicken or the egg, this sort of thing. Because if your heart is and your intention is beautiful, then that will be reflected in water as well. And the water will turn itself into becoming clean and beautiful. However,、um, you know, vice versa. So I always speak about、um, Einstein's theory、um, E equals MC squared. And this is a reflection of how mass consciousness can. Change the vibration of the world into making it a, into a peaceful or better world or not. Therefore,、um, based on this equation、um, that I firmly have love for and understanding of, is that even if there are people or a mass of people out there who、um, may typically not have a beautiful thought or intention at the moment, if enough people do have that, And come from a good heart space, then、um, I believe that those people will have,、um, will be able to turn themselves to within their hearts to become more beautiful and take、um, peace into their own hands. No, I think we've covered it. Is there anything else you'd like to share? Well, I'm going to go to the next one. のお話ですから、まあ、例えば、うん、音楽というジャンルで言うならば、うん、シンフォニーオーケストラが、えー、相対的に、えー、多数の人を癒す音楽とで公共曲ですねで、えー、それぞれのまたあのー場所に応じてのあるいは時代に応じての音楽あるいは楽器もこういう楽器だけのこういうリズムの音楽そういうものがやはり何、えー、て言うんでしょうね代替医療におけるそれぞれのいろんな代替医療があるようにこちらはホイスティックなシンゴのオーケストラの方はこういうことでそれぞれの音楽は、うん、まあ個々の大体医療に通ずるそういう音楽であるというふうに私は考えていますですから今こんだけやはりあの複雑なあの病根を持った社会で生活をしている時にはやっぱり、うん、そう両方のやっぱりコンビネーションが必要になると思うので、えー、あながち私はヘビメタはダメだよというようなことは言ってはいますがひょっとしたらあの場合は言葉が非常に悪かったんでつまりも悪かったんですがひょっとしたら、えー、すごいうるさいヘビメタもある特殊の悪魔的な病根には良いかもしれないそれのところはもうちょっと勉強していきたいと思っています。Okay, so lastly, in terms of、uh, speaking about、uh, on the topic of music,、um, for example, I would like to、um, say how I feel about this is that, for example, symphony、um, orchestra music, that will be a music that will probably have a lot of healing properties towards a big group or a, a bigger audience. So, Like I explained before, there are many m e t h o d o l o g y in regards to alternative therapy.、Uh, so, just like that, I believe that music has、uh, different healing properties、um, that'll be suitable for different individuals as well. For example, like、uh, some people might,、um, depending on the country or the location,、uh, might prefer、uh, suitable for other types of music,、um, depending on the era. You know, different music、um, as well. Rhythm, different instruments might be more applicable or more useful 
for some other uh, group as well. So um, I believe that each, each different music, whether I like it or not myself per, uh, personally, have healing property based on what that individual might require. So in current days with so many diseases going around, I believe that we need as many combinations as possible. So music healing, alternative therapies. So um, I just wanted to explain how, you know, when I'm on stage, I sometimes say that um, heavy metal music is not good. And I actually uh, do say that on stage. Um, however, I would like to look into this a little more because perhaps for some people, heavy metal music might be suitable for them. Uh, it probably was the fact that the lyric that I chose and the music of the heavy metal that I took the crystal photograph at that time was not a good lyric. So perhaps with a good, better lyric might be suitable for some individual that really needs that vibration. So I would like, I still have a lot to um, learn and I would like to research uh, further into music therapy as well. Anything else you want to share for me? So good. Oh, would you hold your glass and do the your ceremony that you say with the water? Water, I love you. Water, we respect you. Water, I'm grateful for you. Uh, so no, Mizumi Tashi, so no, so no, I know, you know, it, you know, I do you. まあ、体験から、あの、お水は、あの、愛感謝という文字に、ミサレキに一番美しい結晶を見せたから、ああ、ありがとう。そして、愛するよという、そういう信頼を一番好きなんだな。で、まあ、それが H2O が、ああ、